Hi, welcome to this week's Transformers Review. Well, this week for Transformers and G.I. Joe, we're wrapping up Women's Month. I think it was a good uh, good month this year, just like every month. Well, this month we're actually ending it up with Autobot uh, Burnout, which is the same mold made as Autobot Skids, as I can show you, because I got Skids right here. Uh, as you can tell, they are mold mates, meaning, meaning that they're from the same mold. And, uh, with the same accessories, but uh, two totally different figures, different paint jobs, totally different characters. But uh, as you see, she doesn't have the white outline on her Autobot symbol on her hood. But uh, before we get to uh, burnout, let's do our do our shout outs of the week. First, at 48 South Loudon Street here in lovely Winchester, Virginia. We you get all your video game needs from the Atari all the way up to current systems. All the games to go for it, all the accessories to go with them, and uh, so on and so forth. So, I would highly suggest you check them out. They're a good, uh, they're, they're good video game store, very good outlet. And if you're looking for toys and collectibles, I suggest going to uh, 115 South Loudon Street to... Time Traveler Toys and Collectibles, where you can see Charles and Jack. And uh, you get all your Transformer, G.I. Joe, Thundercats, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, He-Man, and She-Ra figures. You know, so on and so forth. Silverhawks, and a whole bunch of other collectibles. Hot Wheels. Things of the nature. So I would definitely highly suggest that, and check them out. And, uh, as you can tell, I still got the cold. That side is cold. I'll be glad to get rid of it. But that's not the point. I'm not here talking about reviewing a sinus infection. But, uh, <laughs> that's beside the point. So definitely check this video out, or check these, uh, time travelers out. Unfortunately, I got her, I got this one burnt out here from, uh, Walmart. You know, and she come already in her vehicle mode. But, uh, it's all really well and good. But, um, you can go to, uh, Andy Williams Lane if you got a comic book itch. And check out Four Color Fantasies. We can get Marvel, DC, Image, IDW, all points in between. I would highly suggest checking them out. Uh, they're a great comic book store to go to. And uh, whatnot. So definitely check them out. And while you're there, you can also check out... Uh, if you're looking for a bank, you can go to the Bank of Clark County, and you live in the Winchester, Clark County area, I highly suggest take them out. Check them out. They're a really good bank. I've been there with them for several years now, since 2018. So I highly suggest checking them out. And uh, if you're in the area, definitely check them out. And... Uh, a very good bank, but this channel is also big on mental health awareness, so uh, we're a big supporter of that. So, if you need some mental health uh, issues to, to be taken care of, Max suggests 133 West Bay Scowan Street, Suite Number 10, the Healing Grace Counseling Services. And see Robert C. Brown, definitely check him out <clears throat> and uh, go and see him. He's a good listener, he gives good sound advice. You know, and so on and so forth and all the like. So, uh, definitely go see him. And if you're in the area, and I'll say, if Robert Brown doesn't have the, uh, things that you, the services that you need, may I suggest, uh, Northwestern Community Services Board. You know, you, because you, you definitely could get, reach out to any of their services. And, uh, while you're in the area, I definitely say check that, check it. Check them out. And if you need uh, insurance, whether it be renters, homeowners, uh, motorcycle, car, boat, any kind of insurance, check out uh, State Farm. Like a good neighbor, State Farm is there. And uh, hey, maybe when you get a hold of them, you can get a hold of um, get a hold of uh, Jake. Let's take a look at her accessories. She does have this cool looking double barrel laser. And uh she does have this other laser. 
which you can actually connect the double barrel to the top of this one here and actually make a double gun. And she also has this weird barrel battle axe looking thing, which I usually display it right here on, on the top. And each one of the guns are, I will put on each side, you know, because she has a port on each side for him. You know, and she does have a good uh, SUV mode, and she does roll. You know, nice little design with a little stripe. You can see on the bottom, she does have visible head syndrome. You know, as you can see, the wheels do turn. You know, but other than that, there's her legs. So, visible leg syndrome also. But she's a good looking vehicle. You know, like I said, she does roll very nicely. Um... She's very cool looking. So let's go ahead and look at her in a robot mode. It's uh, burnout in her robot mode. You know, cool looking robot. Well, she does have a good head sculpt. You know, her doors open. I mean, it's sort of blocky. Let's just test her weapons at the moment so I could do her articulation. Uh, come on, release. You know, and uh, just take a look at her articulation. Her head does have some wiggly waggly. Does go side to side all the way around. And uh, see her arms can bend at the elbow as you can see. She can also go all the way around. Out on ball joint. You know it's on a ball joint so you got a range of motion on the arms. Her legs are also on a ball joint. She can, she can split, do the complete splits. She can lift up. She can go back. She's got a knee bend. You know, she's got a lot of good range of motion on her legs. Let's go ahead and look at her battles, battle stats. You know, so here's Burnout with her gear back on, with her guns back on. You know, she's a very cool figure. I'm glad I have her. In the legacy line. I mean, the robot mode has a lot to, to be desired for, but you know, it is what it is. You know, she's a character on Transformers, so I would definitely, you know, you gotta, you gotta have her if you're a completist. I mean, if you're not a completist, you know, I could see see anybody passing it up, but she is a middle tier fi uh, figure. But uh, she's still cool, though. I like the color designs, I like the fact that she's a. Uh, there's a female Autobot, you know. It is what it is. But uh, I'm glad we ended the uh, Women's Month on her. Uh, it's always good to look at female Transformers. But uh, this has been Cobra Island with Burnout. And until next time, until all are one. See you in the next one. Peace.